What's good everybody, it's Nadia and today we're doing something a little bit different. We are unboxing the brand spanking new iPhone XS Max in gold. Alrighty, I don't think this video needs any more introduction. Let's get straight into this unboxing. I know some of you guys out there might like a little ASMR, so I'll peel this packaging off right close to the mic, just for you. So when we open it, we have the normal, you know, Apple booklets that we get, the instruction booklets and all that jazz. We have, you know, your usual Apple stickers, so you can uh, stick them on a PC and pretend like you got a MacBook. <laughs> and of course, inside we have the beautiful XS. Max iPhone. I got the 256 gig in this. Um, I find that the 256 gig in the 7 Plus was enough for me and I take a lot of photos. I haven't actually seen the gold color in person yet, so here we go. <gasps> this is pretty. I don't know if this is like the color is showing up on camera right now. I know I haven't even taken the plastic off, but this is a pretty gold, guys. I'm down with this. Alrighty, you guys know the drill. I'm gonna take this packaging off the phone up nice and close to the mic for you ASMR lovers out there. Here we go. Oh. That sound though. Oh. Ooh, it's like a full mirror. Oh. Perfect for a beauty guru. Look at that, guys. I feel like it's showing up a lot lighter on camera, but yeah, it is very gold. It almost looks like a highlighter. Yep, yep, I took it back to makeup. It's very, like, iridescent. Oh, it's on! Oh my god. Did I turn it on? Must have. Hmm. Hello, hola. All right, so we're gonna go English, Australia, yeah, man. So I'm just setting up the phone now and it literally just says that if I have an iPhone nearby, I just need to bring it close and it will transfer like all my settings. That's kind of cool. So um, that's what I'm gonna do now. All right, so all my settings have now been transferred to this phone. I'm already like connected to Wi-Fi without putting in my Wi-Fi password. Let's go ahead and set up my face ID. I hope if I set my face ID up now, it's still gonna recognize me when I'm not catfishing with this kind of makeup on. Is it still gonna recognize me when I'm ugly? First position your face in the camera frame and then move your head in a circle to show all the angles of your face. Move the iPhone a little lower. I feel like this isn't gonna work when I'm not done up. Setting up your Apple ID. Yeah man, yeah man. Alrighty, I'm gonna go ahead and plug this into my MacBook to restore from a backup. And uh, in the meantime, let's have a look what's in this box. So inside the box, we have the wall charger. This has wrapping on it, so ASMR, guys. Oh, that was over a little bit too quickly. I'll give you some more to indulge in. Oh. This is only like a five watt wall charger, which means that your phone's gonna charge really, really slow. Yeah, I kind of wish that Apple would start putting in better wall chargers, like a lot faster than this. We have the Apple headphones. These are just the normal ones, not the like ear pods. That would be so cool if I had the ear pods, but it's just the normal ones. And then we have the cable to go with the charger. Unlike all the other iPhones, since the headphone jack was taken out, they haven't actually included a adapter in this one. So I think that's them trying to say, you know, get some wireless headphones guys. Come on, jump on the bandwagon. I'm pretty sure it is one of the best-selling Apple accessories. So yeah, that's probably gonna stay that way, especially now. So while my iPhone is still restoring from a backup on my Mac, I'm gonna use my little old grandpa iPhone 7 Plus and just read you guys some of the differences between the iPhone X 
and the iPhone XS Max. So the phone is now available in gold versus just the silver and space gray. So you've got that other color option. It also goes all the way up to 512 gigabytes instead of stopping at 256. It has four gig of RAM versus three gig of RAM. Faster face ID, faster wireless charging. It is more dust and water resistant as well. I think you can leave it in water for like half an hour now. Portrait mode you can do a little bit more with now so you can blur the background and have more control over the way the image turns out once you've taken it. You've got smart HDR for photos versus just the auto HDR. There is stereo recording for video which is definitely a major plus so your sound is gonna be lit. So in terms of the battery life, the battery life on the XS Max is like the longest battery life that any iPhone has ever had and that will be an hour and a half I believe more than than the excess. Front facing camera is 7 megapixel, back facing camera is 12 megapixel. The screen size on this thing you guys is massive. Six and a half inches like. So for the one that I got, I got the 256 gig so it retails at 2059 AUD. That's a lot of nights without food. I do want to show you guys the size difference between the 7 plus and the XS Max. I mean, the 7 Plus is similar. I don't know in like weight, but it's similar to the 8 Plus as well. There really isn't much of a difference. As you can see, they're pretty much, they're pretty much the same size if, yeah, they're like the same size. I mean, there's probably a small difference, but nothing that you would really be able to notice. So if you were worried about like holding it in your hands, if there was gonna be a huge difference there, there isn't. You can already see just like the quality of the screen on this one is so much better. And if you wanted to see the difference in color between the rose gold and the gold, if you were a big rose gold fan, that is the color difference. I was a little bit worried about the keyboard being hard to type on on this because the screen is so much bigger, but luckily it's more bigger in size with the height rather than the width. So where you sort of position your hand when you're typing is really not that much different Anyway, I did want to say a massive thank you to my girl Ellie Durbridge for hooking us up with a big discount on this phone. My bank account adores you right now. So that is it for this iPhone XS Max unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed it from a tech noob. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Share this video if you can. It always helps and I shall see you guys next time. Bye!